it was a magical moment. Point Pleasant Beach lost to Shore Regional 31-0 on Thanksgiving Day, but bounced back just a couple of weeks later to shock the world and beat the Blue Devils to win a state title. And we had a, a championship dinner at the end of the year. We had almost 600 people at the dinner. Uh, we invited anybody from town for coffee and cake. Uh, if you look at our field now, you'll see uh, Jersey Mike's was gracious enough to donate a new scoreboard to us. Uh, the Michigan family who lost Coach Michigan last year, his family donated the new uh, goalposts that you see. And we're excited about the way things uh, are happening here. Last year was uh, very uh, exhilarating for all of us. The outcome was what we wanted, and we hope to do it again this year. The Garnet goals return just four starters on offense, but as coach John Wagner says, the four back are pretty darn good. Headlined by Joe Wagriniak, who had a huge junior campaign. Leading the wing tee attack, Wagriniak racked up 1,592 yards on the ground and 17 scores. He was equally valuable on the defensive side of the ball with five and a half sacks and plenty of hard hits in the open field. Our work ethic is, uh, you know, just the bar set now. We can't get... My, we could go get worse, but obviously the only thing to do is to get better. So that's our first thing on point. Yeah, the line's a very big part of what we do. But when like we're moving the lines, knowing what you're doing, it's very hard to stop. Very fast-paced offense. Jake DiLorenzo was a key to the state championship run on defense with 22 tackles and four sacks during the Garnet Gulls' three postseason victories. Point Pleasant Beach has come a long way on and off the field. The community has come back strong from Sandy, and the Garnet Gulls put a state title on the wall for the first time in eight decades. Now they look to get back to the top. Yeah, you know, this year we have the target on our back, but uh, it makes us work harder. It makes us stay focused more because uh, we know we're getting every team's uh, best game. And so the kids know we've set the bar. That's what we tell the kids. The, the, the bar is set at the beach. Uh, we're the team now that everybody wanted for homecoming games. It's not that way anymore. They know they got to prepare for us. And that's the goal we wanted three years ago, and we're at that point right now. For more Jersey Shore sports, log on to shoresportzone.com.